We just had a bill on moving jobs back into the United States and giving the incentives to do that. So it's right before elections, that's a layup. Obviously, everybody agrees, right? Wrong, <laughs> wrong again, Bob. Uh, no, the Republicans blocked it. They filibustered. They were so mad at the idea of bringing jobs back to America that they filibustered. Now, if it was a political trick and it wasn't really going to bring jobs back to America, I tell you, okay? <laughs> but but it. It's in essence what it does. I mean, it does it through tax incentives, so it's not perfect, right? But Republicans are supposed to love tax incentives. In this case, no, 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 no. So let's break it down. Uh, Associated Press explains Republican senators blocked on election year, an election year bill Wednesday to limit tax breaks for US companies that move operations overseas. Now, think about that for a second. They get a tax break for moving jobs to other countries. They're like, oh, you want to take that American job from. Uh, Wisconsin, from Texas, from Massachusetts, wherever, right? Alabama, great, get it out of Alabama and move it to Germany, Thailand, Vietnam, wherever you want to move it. Just move it, and I'll give you a tax break for it. That's in the books now. That doesn't seem like it would be a popular position in any of those states. But it doesn't matter because it's a popular position among corporate CEOs who fund the Republican Party. So, the bill would have prohibited companies from deducting expenses related to moving their operations to a foreign country. It also would have offered tax credits to companies that move operations to the US from a foreign country. Now, wait a minute, I was given to understand that Republicans love tax breaks to corporations. The one tax break they're against is giving a corporation money to move jobs inside America. <laughs> Insanity, to give you a sense of it. Uh, companies moving. Uh, Jobs overseas, right now they get $143 million of your money through tax breaks over 10 years to move them somewhere else. I mean, isn't that galling to take $143 million out of our pockets so they can move our jobs somewhere else? And the Republicans voted yes, keep that going. This bill would have eliminated that. And the bill would have also given $357 million in tax breaks to companies who move jobs inside the US. But the companies are like, no, 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 no. listen, man. I'm, I'm going to move all the jobs to China and Vietnam because it's cheaper. So you vote to kill that bill. And what do the Republican Party say? Yes, sir. Yes, master. Absolutely, sir. Yes, yes. What do you need me to do? Now, the fact is, the bill would have passed 5442 anyway. That was the vote, 5442. When you add in Harry Reid for technical reasons, it would actually would have gotten 55 senators. Why didn't it pass? The Republicans were so dead set against it, they filibustered it. Under no circumstances are you to move jobs back into America. <laughs> if we had a functioning democracy, <laughs> wouldn't that be kind of the end of the Republican Party? Who, in, really, in Alabama and Tennessee and Mississippi, you're going to say, ha, good old Republicans, make sure you take my job and move it to Shanghai. That'll be, yes, I vote yes. Who, who would do that? Who would do that? But we don't have a functioning democracy. The Republicans know that the amount of money that they're going to get from corporations, multinational corporations, to kill this bill will allow them to buy deceptive ads that'll trick the good people in Mississippi, Alabama, everywhere else into thinking that they're on their side when they're actually completely against them. And then my favorite is, <laughs> according to the Associated Press, Republicans called the bill an election year stunt. <laughs> now, why is that funny? Well, you see, in an election year, you would actually appeal to Americans. And now that's so crazy, so outlandish in Washington that they're like, what a stunt. Trying to get votes from people. <laughs> Don't you know the name of the game is getting money from corporations? People, <laughs> election year stunt. I don't know. Those guys are idiots who are going to vote for me based on the ads I got, based on the money I got from corporations anyway. And then I'm going to take their job. I'm going to move it to Laos. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Idiot Americans, reelect me. I'm your local Republican. Democratic Party is corrupt too, but the Republicans have mastered this game.